Hello friends, this is Ryan Hicks. Today I want to talk to you about visualization and how it works in the Christian's life. The Bible says, For as he thinketh in his heart, so is he. This is something that's been a common practice in everyone's life, but especially in Christian practice, that we understand that we can think in such a way that it can be destructive or can be a benefit to us. And we know this, we all know this from practice, and there's been studies from 1940s and twinnings. There's been all kinds of studies about visualization in humans and how if they're thinking about going through practice of doing something and how that can help them actually do the actual act. In one case, Lori Ansbach in 1989 for her thesis had a study where she had basketball players throwing free throws. They throw 20 free throws and they were either just practicing or they would practice and visualize actual actual movement of shooting the free throws, or they would just visualize only, or they would do nothing at all. And there's been a common, there's been a, a number of these told, but this is one study that's actually published that has been out there. And one of the interesting things to note is that there's, the findings were, when compared to a control group, the mental imagery group did not significantly improve performance. But notice this, they did improve, just not significantly. But this is important to note. Not even practicing, there was improvement made by people that were only doing mental imagery. But the most important thing to note is that the combination of the physical and mental practice produced the greatest amount of improvement with physical practice as second best and mental practice as third best. So if you don't do anything, you're gonna be last every time. But if you do nothing more than mentally imagine the practice, you're gonna do better. And if you actually practice, you're gonna do better than that. And if you practice and have mental imagery as part of your practice, you are gonna do even better. And the study from the 40s and 20s said about five minutes of Im mental imagery of doing something builds upon that base and gives you improvement. This is a story as old as time. We know that as a man thinketh, so is he. If you want to improve in every area of your life, you need to not only be out there practicing whatever you're doing, whether it's business, whether it's activities, whatever it may be, but also spend a few minutes a day thinking through this process, thinking through the actions you're going to be taking, thinking through the business, and you will see great improvement. This is something people do anyway. People will yell about, well, that's New Age. Well, New Age has hijacked it, but the reality is people do this all the time. When you have a presentation before a boss, what do you do? You may sit at home thinking about how you're going to present it, what you're going to say. You may go through it in your mind. People who give speeches do this all the time. They, they may go through the speech numerous times in their mind and mentally imagine themselves giving the speech and that improves their performance. This is something you can translate into every aspect of your life, bring great improvement, and see the realization of the fact that as a man thinketh, so is he.